Well, guys, so today I'm gonna be folding my Infinity Gauntlet. Here it is. Um, it's a very uh, simple model, but it might be a little tricky if you don't know what you're doing. But it's a uh, it's a uh, pretty easy. Okay. So first, uh, you wanna get a sheet of paper, and you wanna cut it in half this um, I think it was 18 and a half by 11 um, I'll, don't call me out on that I'll look it up afterward or it's the other way around so first you want to fold it in half like this And you want to make two squares on each end. Okay. Like so. And bring the end to that crease line right there. Okay, and do the same thing here. So make a square and um, fold that in half. And fold that square in half. Okay, and now you're going to fold this end to the half line point on three times. So first like this. Two, three. Okay, and you're gonna need these crease signs, so make sure you can see it. So crease it. Go over it multiple times, I guess. Yeah. Okay. And you're gonna do the same thing on this side. Okay, run your nail through it a few times so it's easier to see. Because I gotta explain where um, that middle stone goes. Okay, and you're gonna do the same thing. Um, on the side, okay. So fold this right up to the center three times. And the same thing on the other side.
make sure the line is uh, pretty visible. Okay. And now you're going to make the fingers. Okay, so leave two columns, two smaller columns, and you're going to yeah do that for the third one and you're gonna alternate so let me show you so you're gonna fold so you're gonna leave two columns like that and you're gonna fold the third column right up to the third line so you're gonna fold the third column in half so bring this back so leave this back so the two columns here is in the front you're going to bring this back okay so make sure you're doing it the right way and you bring that right up to that crease line okay so folding the third column in half Okay. And you're going to do the same thing here. Okay, so it's the third one. So the fourth one, you're going to fold it in half. So fold this back. Okay. And bring that right up to that third line. So you're going to alternate um, doing all this. You're going to you're going to alternate this all the way to the end. So leave two columns to make the fingers and on the side you're going to do this for the next two column in half bringing the edge right up to the center line and so on and so forth Okay, and then don't fold the fourth one because I will explain what to do next. Okay, 
so just the first three right there and don't fold the fourth one you're going to fold this in half like that not in half like fold this up first then you're going to fold this back like that but this is it for now and I'll continue on the next video okay so thank you for watching and I'll continue watching